So here is a proof of concept of the possibility of integrating the Pandora API with the Windows Phone 7 Media Hub. So what's by default on a Windows Phone device is the Zoom Hub for managing all sorts of media. There's the history, all sorts of information about videos, music. I'm going to focus on music only for now. So I'm going to open the music list. And the first thing that pops up is the list of artists. And I have plenty of them here on the list. All sort of artists. But the thing is, when I click on one of them, or touch, all I get is the list of albums of that artist, and a button that will take me to the marketplace to buy additional tracks from the albums listed there. Or to show the information page on the artist, which will basically list another set of albums available for purchase. And that's it. So what I did is I developed an application that uses the Pandora API to display information about existing artists. So I'm gonna scroll down and open Light Player. It will basically access the media library and load the list of existing artists. Now notice that I'm only loading artists here. It's artist-based selection. Information is loaded online and album art that you see here for some of the artists, for some of them it's not available, but here like ATB Armin van Buren. Uh, the album art is downloaded from an online source that is specified by Pandora. Now when I click on an artist, I get a detail view, I get the artist's biography right here. And I get similar artists. Now the cool thing about similar artists is that I can select artists that are either in the library already or those that are not there yet. So the list itself is fetched from Pandora. But then again, what's cool about it is I can analyze styles by this kind of thing and pick artists from my local library. So if I click on Paul Van Dyke, which is similar to Armin Van Buren, then it will load the information for him and show similar artists for his style. Right here. And as you can see, the integration is uh, pretty smooth in the context of, the, of a third-party application. But this is just the beginning, as I said, it's just a proof of concept to show that it is possible and it is possible to extend the capabilities of the default hub by adding choices as to someone who might be looking to send his music library but he is not familiar with artists that are similar to the style, for example, of his favorite artists.